Hey guys, welcome back to my channel. My name is Naya and I make college lifestyle videos. So if you're into those, go ahead and subscribe. And today we're gonna to be talking about the best beauty Black Friday sales. So when I say best beauty Black Friday sales, I mean, I'm gonna be telling you guys about all the sales I think you should look out for this Black Friday. So I'm gonna be covering like most of the topics, makeup, skincare, and then a little bit of hair. So let's jump into the video. So just to start off, I'm sure you guys have noticed many stores are not open on Thanksgiving or doing many like indoor sales because they don't want too many people because of the virus. So a lot of them have started their sales early like a week early or some of them are gonna start early just so they can eliminate the amount of people that come in to make it just like to have the better sales online instead of in store. So we're gonna be starting off with makeup. The first store I wanted to talk about with the best makeup sales is Ulta. Ulta is always pretty great with their sales. They always have at least one coupon online you can use. So I wasn't surprised when I saw their sales. But the first sale that I saw that's really good is 50% off the Jaclyn Hill palette by Morph. That's a really good deal. I don't know if you guys have seen it, but I've had my eye on this palette for a while. I haven't gotten it yet just because I already have some palettes with similar colors. But yeah, I might look into getting this one. It's 50% off, which is a really good deal. All Morph palettes are really good. I have a couple myself. But you guys should definitely check that out if you're looking to try a new eyeshadow palette. The next one I saw, which is really, really good, is 50% off LA Girl uh, Lip and Face Makeup, which is also amazing. I don't know if you guys have seen, but the LA Girl concealers, like, they're really good. You probably have noticed, like, your favorite makeup YouTuber using them. They're really good, really good coverage. And it's, like, it's, like, really affordable. Like, LA Girl makeup is, like really really inexpensive so for them to still have a like amazing sale is like great you guys definitely need to check that out and the next one that i saw which was a really good deal at ulta is 40 percent off juvia's place uh eyeshadow palettes it's only select palettes but this is still a really good deal juvia's place is also an uh, inexpensive brand and it's also black owned which is amazing and their eyeshadow palettes are really good i have one myself and yeah they also have their own separate sales which i'll talk about later but this is their sale they have with ulta because their her products are sold in ulta stores so another really good sale ulta is having is 40 percent off certain uh makeup revolution palettes and you may the most popular palette by them i know is like it's i think it's called take me to the bahamas you probably have heard of it or seen it i've heard really good things about it i haven't swatched any in the store myself but i may look into it because i do need some highly pigmented palettes so i might look into it but 40 percent off is a really good deal i've used some makeup revolution products never any eyeshadow but yeah i would definitely check that out Another really good one is 30% off of the Body Shop, and you you have to have heard of the Body Shop, like the little um, body butters. They they're like circular, and they also have they always have an element on them, like a tree or something. So check those out. Those are all really good. They all smell good, and yeah, that's a really good sale. 30% off. Another really good deal is 50% off certain Urban Decay palettes. And this is a really good sale. However, I would I wouldn't buy an Urban Decay palette without seeing like checking another store first because I don't know if you guys know, but if you ever go into Marshalls, they sell like Urban Decay palettes and like naked palettes, like older ones. So I wouldn't buy it without checking Marshalls first because of course you can always get it cheaper there. However, 50% is a really good deal. I would still check Marshalls before you buy it though. But yeah, make sure you guys check that one out another really 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 good deal which they also had last year is 50 percent off anastasia beverly hills glow kits and i actually got my first glow kit last year during black friday because they had the same sale and i'm in love with my glow kit i use it like it's like besides my fenty highlighters i use it like consistently i love their glow kits so you guys definitely need to make sure you check that out 50 percent off is a really good deal 
another and the last good deal I saw at Ulta that you guys need to look out for is the 50% off the Tarte foundations. I have never personally tried any Tarte, wait, no, I've tried Tarte like lip products, but I've never tried any Tarte face products, but I've heard nothing but good things. I always see a lot of um, makeup YouTubers using the Tarte uh, concealer, so I would definitely try it. I don't know if I'm going to buy anything this year, but that's a really good deal you guys need to look out for. And yeah, so that concludes all the good Ulta deals I saw. Ulta has plenty of deals, a bunch of deals that I did not mention. But these are like the best ones I saw that stood out to me based off like products I will be interested in and things I've heard good things about. So make sure you guys go look for yourself. These are just like some of them. They have a bunch of deals. So moving on to another makeup brand that's participating in Black Friday online is Juvia's Place, like I mentioned during all the Ulta sales and Juvia's Place is having like crazy sales. If you guys follow them on Instagram, like they're already selling out. It's not even the week of Black Friday yet and they're already selling out with their Black Friday sales. So the first thing that I noticed was the Nubian palettes, which are only $9, 50% off. They're normally 18 and that's really crazy. Like just 50% off of a palette is like, that's not a normal deal. Like that's a good deal. And the next one is their lip balms are 720. I haven't heard anything about their lip balms, but that seems like a really good deal. I believe they're also 50% off. So you guys need to make sure you check that out. And then another thing I noticed was their matte foundations are 50% off. I have heard really, really good things about their foundations. I've seen makeup artists like that I actually know personally buy all their foundations just to use, just to have one of every shade for any client. And like, if somebody's willing to invest like that, then I would say they're pretty good. You guys definitely need to check that out. And plus foundations, like good foundations are always expensive. Like, they're always expensive. So if you find a good foundation, like, on a sale like this, I would definitely check it out and buy it. And then lastly, their Magic Concealers are only $7. I haven't really paid much attention to their concealers, but I'm assuming if their foundations are really good, their concealers, like, aren't far behind. So, yeah, I would definitely check those out and try those. Moving on to the next makeup brand is morph and like i said all every morph um eyeshadow palette i have like i've never been disappointed so they have some eyeshadow palettes that are 50 percent off which is a really really good deal and i would definitely make sure you check those out like if you're looking for just like an everyday palette or something to experiment with like they have it all they have like pastel colors they have nude like nude relaxed fall type colors whatever you're looking for they have it so go check out their sale you might find something you want the next makeup brand is fenty beauty and i don't know if you guys know but i am obsessed with fenty beauty i got on the foundation the highlighter the concealer everything right now like fenty beauty is like my go-to brand i love everything and it's easy you, you find your complexion and you find whatever else you need so for their Black Friday, her MAC lipsticks are 50% off. And if you don't know, I'm pretty sure everybody knows this, but Fenty Beauty is owned by Rihanna. So it's black owned, which is also a plus because who doesn't like supporting a black owned business? But her matte lipsticks are 50% off, which is a really good deal. Her select highlighters are 50% off. And I'm wearing one right now. I forgot. I think I'm wearing afternoon snack. But her highlighters are like top tier and they're normally pretty like you know on the pricey side most of her stuff is on the pricey side i highly recommend it though it's definitely worth it so since it's on sale make sure you check it out because it's definitely worth it and then lastly oh no sorry that was the last one so yeah her matte lipsticks and then some of her like highlighters are on sale so make sure you guys go check that out so the last makeup brand that I'm going to mention today is ColourPop and ColourPop is also very inexpensive. They recently uh, started selling in Ulta stores. However, this sale is separate. It's not included in the Ulta sales. So some of their holiday palettes are 20% off, which is a really good deal. I've never tried ColourPop uh, eyeshadow, but I've heard really good things. So make sure you guys go check that out. And yeah.
So next we're going to move on to skincare and the first brand that I saw with the Black Friday sale is The Ordinary. I've tried The Ordinary and it hasn't really worked too much for me but I thought I would include this because lots of people will vouch for The Ordinary and lots of people love The Ordinary. So they're doing a 23% off sale and it's not, I don't think it was their decision but the company that owns them, they're doing like a site wide 23% off sale and I was like kind of confused why 23 because that's a weird number but when I was reading it it said that they didn't want to like they didn't want people to rack up on things they didn't need so they didn't want people to like use things that they don't really need on their skin just because of a big sale which kind of makes sense but I mean what would be the difference between 23 and 25 but hey make sure you guys check that out and the next skincare brand is Milk Cosmetics. And I've heard nothing but great things about Milk Cosmetics. I still have yet to try the Hydro uh, Grip Primer. And I really want that. Like, that's on my Christmas list. If I don't get it, I'm getting it myself. But I've heard nothing but great things. It was pretty hard to distinguish what was, like, Black Friday sale and what was, like, regular based off their website because they don't have, like... Like most sites, if something's on sale, they'll cross out the regular price and put the sale price in red. But the Milk website is like, I guess it's a bit underdeveloped. I don't know. It was pretty hard to understand. But make sure you guys go check that out. And I'm pretty sure if you do a little research, you can find like what's on sale. But yeah, check that out. Okay, so the last section we're going to do is hair care. And the first brand I'm going to mention is The Pattern by Tracy Ellis Ross. So this brand is black owned. You might know Tracy Ellis Ross from like Girlfriends or something. But I've actually used this brand myself and I love it. I love her condenser, her condenser, her conditioner from for uh, intensive curls. So it's like, you know, type three to type four. She has like, she has certain products for each hair texture, which is also really cool. But yeah, certain products by her are going to be on sale. So make sure you guys go check that out. Support black owned businesses. And then another business that I, another business. And then another brand that I really love is TGIN. And I forgot what it stands for. Oh, thank God it's natural. Sorry, thank God it's natural. But TGIN, that's what I call them. And then all their hair products are $9.99. That was on their website. That was really, really, really hard to believe. All their products will be $9.99. But that's what their website says, so they better come through. But I'm definitely going to that sale because I love their leave-in conditioner. Like, all their stuff is always really good. So make sure you guys check that out. And the last hair care Black Friday sale that I saw, which was really crazy and really good, is uh, I've been really looking into getting a hair diffuser because I don't have one. So whenever I want to wear my natural hair, I'm going to need one. But I was looking at Walmart and they have a bunch of hair diffusers on sale. And the lowest one I saw was like $13. So I'm like, like y'all better go get your hair diffusers if you don't have one. And $13, that's a really good price. I don't know the quality of it, but I just when I saw it, I was like, wow. But yeah, make sure you guys go check that out. And I also forgot to mention, if you guys don't know already, I have my own natural hair care business. And I am also doing Black Friday. All my silk regular bonnets are only $9, which is 25% off. So make sure you guys go shop with me. Check out my Instagram at n-i-y-s dot hair care nice hair care and shop with me but this is the end of the video thank you guys so much for watching i hope you guys catch all these good black friday deals because i will definitely be catching some and yeah don't forget to like and subscribe and i'll see you guys in my next video